Well, good morning. We have a 2021 Springdale. It is a Keystone product. Uh, it's a 311 RE. Um, not going to spend too much time on the exterior again. I think you guys have kind of figured out that's how I, uh, I like to do these things. Um, I will point out it does have power tongue jack, does have power um, stabilizers, huge awning, light strip underneath, exterior speakers, a place to hang your television right there. These cool nifty stairs everyone just absolutely adores. Um, does have an exterior shower kind of right by the door. Again, quick glance at the weight. 8260 for those of you who don't feel like pausing. And we'll get you in here out of the road noise. Well, I guess I'm going to walk straight into the fridge because let's face it, if I'm camping, this is probably exactly where I'm going straight in from the door. A little storage pantry on the side. Pretty deep. Put a bunch of stuff in there. Uh, spinning you around. You've got your kitchen. Cabinet storage. Very, very well lit. I uh, am actually a very big fan of this little magnetic uh, thingamabob here. I don't really know what it's called, so we'll just go with a thingamabob and life will be grand. Moving on over into the living area, this is uh, pretty much the highlight of the camper. It is, I mean, it's huge. There's no other way to put it. Rear entertainment, televisions on that uh, swivel mount. Looks like it's a little bit rocky from the ride in. Fireplace, speakers, Bluetooth stereo. I do have a uh, jackknife couch over here. And I guess as long as we're doing this, I'll uh, put you in a little secret. Half move it and you've got all that storage room. So, good place uh, not to forget about, don't lose out about. You can actually put things there. Nice booth dinette. Um, there is some uh, backlighting above the slide out. You can kind of see the white glow. With all these windows, it really brightens it up, so it might be hard to see. Let me walk back here, just kind of give you a front view. So, again, you got like a dance hall back here, you can do whatever you want. I'll move from the back to the front now because there's actually a few goodies up here. I actually really like this uh, thermostat, don't know why. Nice John, ample area, even for uh, us bigger folk. Traditional sink, big shower. Got the surround, of course. Skylight above. I'm not really sure which way this mirror moves, but bear with me. Pretty straightforward medicine cabinet. No news there. Does have, of course, the skylight with the fan in it and then some hanging. Moving on into the bedroom, they do a pretty good job in here. Double shelves, some hanging, power on uh, both sides of the bed. This is actually designed to be a hamper, so you lift it up, you put a laundry basket down there, drop your clothes, you know, it's all gone, rest is history. Um, the big story up here, or in the surprise, other than your TV mounting bracket location, is going to actually be this rear front, however you want to call that closet and it's fairly sizable i mean i could probably walk in here stand uh, you can't see it but i'm in here this thing's about head height i'm six foot tall so you're you're right there uh back to the bedroom again a little unassuming that it actually has that so kind of impressed it does have the barrel roof top look of course it is a keystone product so you'll get the same awesome warranty on it if you guys have any questions, just let me know.